Hello everyone, Jennifer Griffin here with another tutorial. Here is my blog, laptoplifestyleonline.co.co. I'm going to, I'm doing a series of how-to tutorials and I'm adding them here in my blog. So if you want to get to my tutorial videos, you just need to go to laptoplifestyleonline.co and click on the categories and there will be a category with how-to videos okay so with that being said let's get to the tutorial right now I am going to create an image using pagemoto.com I'm gonna sign in with Facebook okay it's gonna bring me into the into the site and I'm going to create a thumbnail image for a video that I'm uploading on YouTube. So you can create Facebook cover photos by clicking on cover photo or you can or you can click on post design. So I'm going to click on post design and it's going to load a whole bunch of templates for me to use for me to choose from. So let's find the template that I want. Let's see, they have some Halloween ones. They need to update those with Christmas. They'll be updating those with some Christmas templates and Thanksgiving templates. Okay, I'm going to use... Let's see, let's see. Hmm. Okay, there's some more down below. Okay, I'm going to use... Okay, this is the one I want to use. Oops. It went away, went away. Okay, I'm going to use this one. So you just click on the template. And, okay, it's not loading correctly. I don't know why. Uh, let me choose another one. Okay, leave this page. I'm going to click on post design again. Okay, let's say I wanted this one. I'm just going to click edit. I can remove everything on here. So let me show you how to use this. So I don't want this, so I'm going to click on it and then I'm going to click trash. I don't want this. I'm going to click trash. I don't want that. Trash. I'm going to delete all of these things here. I don't need any of those things. Okay. I can change the background color, I can change the fonts, everything, okay, oops, okay, let's see, okay, trash, now, um, okay, one more little thing to delete, alright, so now I have everything blank, if I wanted to change this color, yellow actually the middle of it uh, let's see yeah I removed the template um the frame okay now if I wanted to change that to yellow I could simply change it to yellow I could grab the text box You want to click on that and then grab, actually I should grab big. I'm going to remove this one. So I drag this text wherever I want it to appear. I want it to appear here. Then you click on the middle and it will open up over here. And then I start typing what I need to type. 
how to um, how to create okay now I'm gonna select text again big text drag it to where I want it to go and I'm gonna type again how to create a broadcast email and then I'm gonna click text big text again how to create a broadcast email using using Orwell. Okay, so that's what I wanted to say. Now I'm going to drag this text where I want it to be. Okay. Now I can also Okay, I can also change the color of the text. So I want it to be black. So I'm going to change that to black. I'm going to change this also to black. Or I could change it to blue. Let's see how blue looks. Also, if I click inside the box, it will open up some um, some background images. Just want to show you that you can change your background image around. See, you can change it to the sky. You can change it to any background image you like. I can add a dog. Okay. You know, any, any background image you want, see, if I wanted that, I could just change this to white, and it'll probably bring it out better, see, but I'm not using that background, okay, so just wanted to show you that you can choose a whole bunch of different backgrounds, so I'm going to click replace, and I'm going to put it back to yellow, because this is just a thumbnail for my YouTube channel. Okay, so that's how you create an image. I'm going to save it. Um, okay. I'm going to save this image to my computer. Actually, this looks like it has too much space. Okay. So I'm saving the image. Sorry, this video is starting to be too long. Okay, let's save as. Any day now, okay. So I'm gonna save it right here. Okay, now it's saved. Then I'm gonna go to my YouTube channel. This is the video that I wanna upload. See, instead of using these, I like to create custom thumbnails so that when people go to my video, first they see my little, you know, title, my thumbnail image. So I'm going to click here to upload the image I just created. Click on picture. And go to the folder where it's at. I know which folder it's in. Then I am going to locate my image. Click open. Okay, and there goes my image. So 
So now it's highlighted, so that thumbnail will show up here. See, there it goes. Now I can publish my video. And that's how, that's how you uh, create a thumbnail image using Pagemoto. So that's all for now. Hello everyone, uh, Jennifer. Pause the video, okay. So that's all for now. That's how you use Pagemoto.com. And you can create various e images for anything that you want to create it for. Okay, so to find more videos, go to laptoplifestyleonline.co and check in the category how-to videos and find what you need there. Alrighty? Thanks for watching.